Good everyone, I hope you guys have an amazing day. Um, so what I'm going to do today, right, I will show you how to link uh, an article to the case, right? Uh, because what happens is, right, you know, you might get a uh, call from a customer and then the customer might say, hey, I have a query. Can you answer that query? So if you're, so if you're creating a case, uh, you know, say if you get a phone inquiry or an email inquiry, right, uh, you can actually... Uh, look at that knowledge article, you know, uh, to re reply to your customer. Uh, so if I go to, so what I'll do, uh, I will do a new case, okay? And let's say, um, you know, just search for, i just do an account. I'll create a new account, just a dummy account, right? Uh, so let's say a customer called. Um, and he wants to know uh, whether, you know, he needs to have a license to install the solar panel uh, for his DIY, right? Exactly the same uh, knowledge article we published yesterday. So, so what I'll do, I will case origin, I just say phone. Um, so I wanted to know, can we... Um, do we need a license for solar panel installation, right? So, so this is the case I've created. Uh, but uh, if you look at it here, right, uh, I don't have any option to see any knowledge article or I don't have an option to link an article here. Uh, so, which is not really great, right, if you look at it, because obviously... If I'm a case representative or a case agent, I would like to know what article uh, I can um, link it, right? I mean, I can obviously search it, but that's not really very convenient, right? So what I'll do, I will change this layout a bit, and so I can attach the knowledge article to it, right? So what I'll do, I'll go here, sorry, here, uh, edit page, um, and... Uh, <clears throat> And I'll just do knowledge, right? So let it load. And uh, I'll just attach somewhere here, right? Okay, and attach it here, <clears throat> and I'll save it. And I'll say activate. Right, just org default. Okay, just go here. Assign as an org default. And uh, <clears throat> I'll save it. Save it. Activation. Oh, yeah, this is something I thought. Okay, so I'll go back. <clears throat> and uh, scroll, just refresh it again. And I'm just going to scroll down, <clears throat> and I have a knowledge, right? So I will say simple fact, okay? So I've assigned this article. <clears throat> so I looked at this article, right? And I can see the knowledge article here. And, and that's right. And then I got this, you know, I have looked at it. So this is a, uh, sorry, this is a question customer asked. Do you need to have a license? So the answer is no. So I got this information from here. Um, and so go here. Do this the case again. And uh, I just go here. And the drop down. And I'll say attach the article. So article has been attached. Now if I go to the, the related list, I can see the article attached, right? So this is just an indication uh, to let, um, you know, a customer know that, you know, next time <clears throat> uh, if you call, this is your case ID and, you know, and a new agent will look at it. We obviously can see that, okay, so they referred this article to give them the information. And if there is some issue with the article, so obviously you can, you can, um, you know, fix it in the future, right? Because what happens, you know, you, as an agent, you looked at this article and said, hey, you don't need um, uh, a license to do 
uh, solar panel installation for your own DIY. But let's say for whatever reason, uh, the legislation changes, right? And and you do actually need it. And a customer calls back and says, hey, um, last time you guys told me, right, there is a, I don't need to have a license, but I figured out there is, if you need to have a license. So obviously when they refer the case back, right, they say, oh, this, the previous agent referred to this uh, article. So the, obviously they can go, go and change it. So that's one of the advantage what I've seen from my own personal experience. Uh, so this is all I wanted to talk about in terms of knowledge. We covered knowledge. This is all you need when you, you know, wanted to uh, do stuff in experience cloud, right? Obviously, uh, this is more related to uh, service cloud certification. So that's why I'm not really getting into you know, emailing the article to the customer and other stuff, right? We, we don't want it to do that. That's a separate series. Uh, if you wanted to know more, you can always look at my playlist uh, in Service Cloud uh, Certification. You will get to know more information. But for uh, Experience Cloud Certification, this is all we need. So that's pretty much I wanted to cover, uh, ladies and gentlemen, today. I hope you guys have an amazing Monday. Adios.